Hi, yo, YouTube. We're back at Dust and Elysian Tale, and I, uh, oddly serene area to be in the middle of a volcano. There are butterflies, there are flowers. I think I saw a rabbit or two a while ago. It just, yeah, well, a while ago, I mean, like, at the bottom of this cliff. Like, yeah, it goes from giant burning inferno land to this thing. Um, but yeah, we're almost to General Gaius. I basically just walk through this door, and then we go fight him. Uh, I was also lied to about being able to leave the other area. You can straight up leave here anytime you want. I thought the uh, guard that said, oh, once you go through this gate, you're never coming back, or you can't turn back, I thought it was like block it off, but no, you can walk out if you want. Uh, but yeah, here's General Gaius. How you doing, buddy? General Gaius! Wait! Wait! Just a moment. Lower your weapons. Yay, for plot. Not plot. Weapons. Uh, what you is this word I'm looking for? To answer for General. It doesn't matter, I'll and let him talk. you, my friend? A year ago I heard stories of your death at the hands of a child, no less. Now, here you stand, not only alive, but leading the very creatures we've been charged to destroy. You've been charged to destroy, not me. What happened to you, Cassius? Cassius? Do you not remember your own name? What have those damned moonbloods done to you? What did you call me? Cassius! That's who you are! Don't listen to him! You're Jin now! Remember no, I'm dust! You're remembering now, aren't you? Together, nothing stood in our way. We shaped this world together. And together, we can finish what we started. You ordered the deaths of countless people. Countless Moonbloods. Moonblood sympathizers. Anyone that stood in your way. Yes. And you carried them out. Lower your blade, old friend. I'm not your First friend. To destroy these Moonbloods once and for all. Then I can help rid you of these fantasies that have spoiled your mind. Just listen to me. Cassius was my name. Was. Emphasis matter. on was. It's all that matters. All those people I killed, fidgets. How could I possibly redeem myself in a mere few days? You can't. You cannot, Dust. Oh, well, this look at that. It's never about redeeming Cassius. But then, you are not Cassius. But I share his form, his very soul. That doesn't matter! Why do you keep saying that? Because you're not just Cassius! Wow, I forgot how, uh... I tried this, uh, yesterday or so, and I forgot how much talking there was. I just want to go punch him in the face! Come on! Cassius would destroy the Moonbloods. But Jin, he would protect them. No, Fidget. You're wrong. Jin didn't do any of those things. Then you finally come to your senses. No, I'm dust. Jin is oh, right, yeah, I forgot about this part, too. This is Cassius. Their souls now live within me, constantly reliving that fateful day. Forever in battle, forever at odds. But as long as I live, I still have a choice. Then what are you? I am dust. I am justice in Oh, I'm justice, not Brought dust. To this world by forces beyond <clears throat> comprehension. A cleansing storm to sweep across the land and purge it of your foul presence. Woo. I am dust. And your campaign ends here now. Throw down your weapons and surrender, or you will face an enemy unlike any this world has ever seen. Yay! Cassius, please, don't do this. You know you cannot win. Let's end this. Never tell me what I can and cannot do. But yeah, like I said, I tried this a few days ago, and I definitely needed a... I needed more than 400 health. Uh, because I didn't have any healing items. Do I win out on those trades? I don't think I do. Ow! Um, check those real quick. <clears throat> Zap him a bunch. Uh, I also have a, a ring on that, like, makes Fidget deal, like, triple my damage. It's pretty fantastic. <clears throat> oh yeah! Who can't win now, Cassius? Or no, I'm Cassius, you're Gaius. Right, my bad. I am winning those trades, okay. Sometimes I get launched backwards like nine feet. 
other times it actually does do damage. Yeah, just keep zapping them for me, Fidget. That, that'll help. I wish I could actually hit you to get my uh, energy bar back, but whatever. Nope. Oh, ow. Apparently that counts as a counter, but, I mean, ow, okay, that just was him punching me in the face. Suck it! <laughs> Through the wall you go! <clears throat> On to stage two. I'm assuming that there's like four stages to this fight, but... You cannot win, Cassius. You never could beat me. Stop calling me Cassius! There was a time when you stood by my side. We were yeah, that time has gone, has long gone. General, I'm not your ally, and I'm not your friend. Now raise your blade or drop it. You never could scare me either, Cassius. Very well. To the death. I find it weird that the assassin can't take on the tank. Well, I mean, like, I do play a lot of MOBAs, so assassins fighting a tank are a terrible idea. Oh, wait, those, those are my guys. I was trying to hit them. I'm just gonna just gonna wail on you. This works pretty well. It was working pretty well until he did that. My turn. Oh man, fidget zapping you doesn't do all damage, or all those zaps don't do damage. Damn it. Whatever. I'll chug another uh, whatever it was, some kind of weird steak thing, or at least it looks like steak. I don't know what exactly it is. Let's not stand in that. Let's not stand in the uh. The giant zappy warps. I can only imagine that's a bad idea. Ow! That was my hit. That was my face you hit! Stop it! Just let me kill you. Ow! Suck it! The only thing I have a problem with right now is that my dust storm does most of my damage and I can't use it against him. Like, it hits him like twice and then he like breaks me out of it. Woo, down we go. Into the final stage of the fight, I think. I hope. Anything, Cassius? Why would you draw your blade against your fellow soldiers? Why would you draw your blade against me? Because I keep telling you I'm not friggin' Cassius. World, Gaius. You and your soldiers cannot be allowed to continue your campaign. This world belongs to the strong, Cassius. It belongs to us. Don't you remember your duty? Don't you remember your friends? Nope. I remember everything. Oh. And it changes nothing! Okay, the complete opposite direction that I went. Oh, goody. More, uh... More Cassius' soldiers. More of Cassius' soldiers. I've learned that most normal people don't like getting exploded by bombs. Whee! <laughs> I don't know if that's actually dealing damage, but it's fun to do. It also makes me feel good blowing up Gaius with bombs. It's a... Uh, ow! Okay, so I didn't have the... Uh, oh, I rolled into those. <laughs> Damn it. Nope, let's keep out of that. Explosions! I love explosions. Oh! She's been silenced. I don't know how that... Ha well, I can kind of figure it out. I got hit by one of those orbs. I'm assuming that's what silenced uh, Fidget. Explosion! Woo! Apparently I stunned him. Oh, there he goes. Are we done yet? This is where it ends, Gaius! Yay, shouting! This battlefield reminds me a lot of uh, Lady Tethys' uh, arena. So is this going to play out like friggin' the end of Lord of the Rings? Like, are one of us going to fall into the volcano? Uh, I almost did, so yeah. Oh, there we go. Yep. Just like end of the Lord of the... Well, okay, I, have, I can't actually say that. I've never watched the Lord of the Rings movies. Oh, God. Why do you get like nine jumps? That's not fair. Land in the lava with me, you bastard. Friggin' cheater. Ow. Ow! Come on, get up! <laughs> there we go. No, I'm not landing in the friggin' lava again. I'm gonna stay up here. Get away from me, you weirdo. Zap him full of lightning. 
No! Go away, you giant creepy orbs! No! Stop it! In case you can't tell, I'm having fun now. Um, the, uh, the first couple areas were just like a Ow! Come on! The first, uh, first couple rooms were just a, uh, exercise and, uh, patience. Now this is just fun. This is just me having fun. Because, like, I don't know... Yeah, I, I said in the other video, uh, or, like, the video before this one, um, that, uh... <coughs> ah, excuse me, I just gotta really scratch my nose here, uh, and finish this thought. I don't like enemies that can guard, because it, like, it breaks the normal... F it breaks my flow of combat. I just want to, like... I just want to wail on you for nine hours and, like, nine hours straight. I don't care if you have, like, a gazillion HP. I just want to hit you a lot. And if you can guard it, it makes it very boring for me to fight you. Because I have to play around your ability to guard, and I understand that's like... Oh, wait, am I dying? Screw my story, am I dead? Achievement unlocked, and the dust settles. What's going on here? Unlocked. Above and beyond the call of duty. Or above and beyond the call. Oh. I'm crawling now. Okay. I hear you, Gaius. What are you screaming about? This is me crawling, by the way. And in case you can't tell, this is most certainly, fin most certainly the finale. Am I... Am I about to throw you into the volcano? Is that what's going to happen? Are you beyond redemption? Am I going to kill you? Hello. Hello, sir. You, you're not That's what I've been telling you for like the last five hours, dude. Come on. Oh, am I about to throw you into the... Yep. Okay, see ya. See ya, Gaius. My duty done. My, uh... Vengeance complete. Am I dead? Am I straight up dead? Interesting cutscenes. I like them. Nope, not having him. We did everything right, Dust. Everything we were supposed to do. And sometimes that's not enough, Fidget. When the life threat calls. Aw, oh, man. Fidget. Thank you. Goodbye, Dust. Man, I... Okay, I understand now why there's no, uh... No sequel to this. I suppose I did kind of like end the, uh, oh yeah, I'm just melting in the lava. Okay. Wow, that was, um, wow. Wow. I was not ready for that one. <laughs> um, see now, in any other circumstances, I would be emotionally invested in this, but I'm like, just trying to like blow through it. I mean like, it, yeah, sad ending, but. I can't exactly say I'm torn up over it. And the Blade of Aura is losing his runes. Why? See you, see ya, Aura. Good talking at you, sir. But yeah, that's a uh, that's Dust and Elysian Tail done. Through the actions of our Sen Mithrarin Dust, the Moonblood race is finally free. We will never forget his sacrifice. For the deeds that saved our fairy world, we shall always remember what happened here. Dust's sacrifice will allow the Moonblood race to rise again, to rebuild our glorious civilization, and live peacefully among the races of this world. Though it may appear that Dust has fallen here today, the force of good is not so easily extinguished. Send Mithrani. See Ara. Dust, a current, the winds of change, a harbinger of storms yet to come. Dust. 
Alrighty, so yeah, that's the end of Dust and Elysium Tale. Thank you for everybody who's been watching. Um, <clears throat> I'll catch you on the next series. I just don't know what that is yet. I haven't decided what that's going to be. But yeah, this has been fun. Uh, I hope some of you who have been watching, all of like maybe four of you who have been watching, decide to try this game out. It's definitely worth it. Although, I suppose you don't have to try it anymore because you saw the whole thing. Give or take a couple of... Uh, Give or take a couple of my uh, side quests. But yeah, I'll catch you next time, guys. This has been fun.